Today's lesson is basic reading commands with NVDA. We're going to go over this little news article as a sample for our reading today and go over the basic commands of using NVDA to read in a document. And of course we're in a Word document here, so most of you are going to be familiar with that. The thing to know is that you can move the reading focus without moving the cursor. So I'm going to insert my cursor here at the uh, beginning of business news. And if I press my right arrow, it's going to read the next letter. U S I N E S S. And if I press my left arrow, S E N. If I press the arrows with the control key, it's going to read the next word with right. News. And if I press left, it's going to read the previous word. Business. If I use the down arrow, it will move down through the document and move the cursor with it. Blank. And when I get to a blank line, of course, it tells me it's blank. October 1st. 2018 slash 424 p.m. slash updated 17 hours ago. Heading level 2 Thomson Reuters closes deal with Blackstone. When it gets to a heading, it tells me that it has a heading. Toronto, Reuters, Thomson Reuters Corp. Try.2, Try.N, said on Monday it had completed the sale. And you see that it only reads the line that the cursor is in from the beginning to the end and it doesn't read it as a sentence. If I want to read it as a sentence I press the ALT key and the arrow down. The news and information provider agreed in January to sell a 55 percent stake in the business which provides data and news primarily to financial customers in a deal which values the total F&R business at about 20 billion dollars. You notice it stops here at the period. If I want to read the sentence above it, I press Alt and Up arrow. Toronto, Reuters, Thomson Reuters Corp. I just pressed the Control key to stop the reading of that sentence. But that's how you move through a document using Alt and Up and Down arrows to read the sentences. And if you just want to read the line you're in, you just use the arrow up and down for that separately. Now we left off up here and this is a giant paragraph. What I'm going to show you next is that you can read individual paragraphs. The control key with a down arrow. From the remainder of the proceeds, the company said it would redeem $4 billion of debt, keep $2 billion of cash on its balance sheet to fund acquisitions, and use $1 billion to cover expenses related to the transaction. And if I want to read the next paragraph, I again press control and down arrow. Following the deal, Thomson Reuters had said it. If I want to go back up a paragraph, I just press the control and up arrow. From the remainder of the proceeds. And you can see that it's easy to navigate paragraph to paragraph. And I hope you have enjoyed this lesson about reading with NVDA.